So, so we're basically saying it was a combination of maybe the church and medicine that fused these ideas of what made a woman and the qualities of a woman and how they differed from a man. Yes, I, I, but I would say that they'd certainly fused by this point. So throughout society, um, the, the attitudes are deeply patriarchal and it absolutely draws on on the, the, the strength of the church and the, and the strength of medical opinion to create this kind of edifice that justifies men's power and women's submission. Um, and so this affects women, whether they are ordinary village women who are more likely to be suspected of being witches than men because they are uh, more easily tempted by the devil, or uh, royal women like Anne Boleyn, who are more easily like thought to be sexually voracious, you know. So the, there's a there's a continuity in terms of thought about women that is generally quite a negative one.